A 24-year-old Manny is dead tonight after a struggle with mall security. Police say Mackenzie Cochran of Ferndale was pepper sprayed and detained by mall cops. But well, tonight, new cell phone video reveals Cochran was having a hard time breathing during the struggle. Jeff Vaughn is standing by live at Northland Mall tonight with a look at that videotape. Jeff? Yeah, we don't know, Stephen, what caused Mackenzie Cochran's death. An autopsy is being performed. But what we do know, when you take a look at this video, he was begging to breathe. Shopper captured this video of what appears to be three Northland Mall security guards detaining Cochran after Southfield police say the man was pepper sprayed. The video shows one security guard sitting on the man's legs, holding his feet. Another has his knee in the man's back and is struggling with McKenzie's arms. And a third security officer appears to be kneeling next to the man and maybe holding McKenzie's head and neck. Then come the cries for help. Kenzie desperately telling the officers, I can't breathe six times. The mall cops respond with, In case you missed it, mall security tells McKenzie, begging to breathe, you talk, you can breathe. Southfield police say the 24 year old lost consciousness but had a pulse when they arrived. Cochran later died at a hospital. I visited the home of the 24 year old Ferndale man Wednesday night. Jeff Vaughn, 7 Action News. Love to talk about Mackenzie Cochran. But the family was too devastated to talk. They are aware of this video and tell me an attorney has been hired to bring justice to their loved one's death. Well, I'm told that Cochran may have visited the Northland Mall several times over the last few days, and at one point in time, he may have made a violent threat. A late word tonight here to 7 Action News. We did speak to that family's attorney. They do say, quote, what we believe happened is they oversprayed Cochran with pepper spray, and his respiratory system was compromised. They say if he was given oxygen, he may have survived. That's the latest from Southfield. I'm Jeff Vaughn, 7 Action News. No word from the mall yet tonight? No, no official word yet. Uh, uh, tonight, Stephen, but uh, we understand that the uh, attorney is going to hold a press conference tomorrow. Southfield police are investigating. We hope to learn more to then.